And a couple of weeks later, here I am again, looking at 128 along Burma Road. Through the woods there, you can kind of see it, the salt shed and the old stub of Route 95. I was exploring it earlier and we'll do more so later. I wanted to find this though. When I was last here, I probably wasn't that far up the road. And this is the cool little riverside trail that's referenced in the Fowl Meadow section of the official Great Blue Hills Reservation map. So this is what I propose to examine today. And I'll pretty much go all the way up to the spot where I met the river the last time I was here. This particular trip is basically given to figuring out all the last trail tie-in mysteries of the lower end of the Fowl Meadows section. And as you can see, the river's running high and the trail just sort of follows it this way. And Skunk Cabbage has already taken a jump on things. The spring has been so delayed here that all of the normal cycles are accelerated. When I was here two weeks ago, the Skunk Cabbage was still barely out of its hood. Ooh, some colorful bracket fungi. And we're working our way down along this riverside trail, getting a little bit further away from Burma Road over there. Almost like an Eskerish berm, except no doubt man-made or flood-tossed. And we just follow this bit for a while. What a great little hike. Uh, something's fully green already. Apple tree looks like.
Yeah, we came upon a spot with lots of paper wasp nests. There's one. Looking like, as my friend noted, a desiccated turkey carcass. And then there's the other one. The river's flowing nicely. It's still sort of high, though it looks like it's dropped a bit. This goes down towards 128 and uh, meets Burma Road at its furthest end before the highway uh, bisects it. And this is our way up to the other crossing where I was Monday the 7th. Here's some blackbirds, in addition to the low hum of motor vehicles. Now we come to our first little clear stream draining one of the vernal wetland areas. And a charming trail it is. A lot of interesting bird noises. I wonder what that peep peep zeet zeet is. Ah, it's down low. Oh yeah, you can see the river was up over this stuff recently. Old Naponsa. That's a lively place, this fellow, you know. Another little stream crossing, and you can see the flood banks on either side built up over the years. More bird noise. It's like we've come upon some kind of tree jam mess. Jeez. Pinching the thing of it. It's got a good current. Roll on the ponset. Roll on. 